our channel. Today, I'm gonna show you how I do my under eye makeup. I have a lot of people on Instagram being like, I love your under eyes, show me how you do it, do a tutorial, what products do you use, how do you do it, how do you apply this? And then I have a bunch of other people on Instagram being like, wow girl, that highlighter is just way too much. Lay up the highlighter girl, the under eye is so bright. Oh, so I wonder if she knows what ugly her under eye is. Way too much makeup. <laughs> what do you think about my under eye? Do you love it or do you hate it? Oh, the reviews are in. It sucks. I tend to like a brighter under eye. For me personally, I just don't feel pretty without it. So that's just how it goes. Love it or hate it, I'm gonna show you what I do. Let's get to it. So I'm gonna start by removing all the makeup under one of my eyes so I can redo it and show you guys each step. Starting with Becca Under Eye Brightening Corrector, I'm going to use a concealer brush and begin to apply the product in a triangle shape. This product is amazing! Then take a beauty blender and lightly press the edges of the triangle to blend them so there's no harsh lines. Notice here I don't touch the center of the triangle as I don't want to move or take off any of the product. I just simply want to pat all the edges and blend them well. Then with Sephora Bright Future Concealer in Meringue, I'm going to trace that same triangle and cover it evenly. Going back in now with the concealer brush, I'm going to lightly spread the product exactly where I want it. Now with the Beauty Blender, I'm going to lightly press on the outer edges of that triangle just like I did before and really just make sure all the lines are blended in. Now I'm going to take Benai Translucent Powder in Pretty Pink and I'm just going to pack the product on with a dense powder brush. You can see here that I'm patting it on. I'm not doing any swiping motions, just patting and building. And I'm following, again, that same triangle shape. Then you're gonna take a softer powder brush and lightly dust off all the excess powder. With Benai Translucent Powder, this time in Super White, I'm going to use my dense powder brush again and I'm making a very small triangle at the top of the bigger triangle we already created. And go back in and dust it off with a soft brush. Lastly, using Becca Shimmerine Skin Perfector in Moonstone, I'm going to use this to make my cheekbones pop and give them that glowy look. I'm lightly dusting this product at the top of my cheekbones and making sure to stay towards the outside of my face. Let me just touch up my blush and voila! So that is how I do my under eye makeup. And I hope that you liked it and that maybe you learned a thing or two. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day. Bye!